shops and, and things like this, and we go into dealerships, it's, it's, it's not uncommon that the owner will say, well, where do you want to meet with the, with the service techs? And so where, where do I always meet with service techs? I say, I want, to meet, I want to meet them in the shop. I want to go through everything I have in the shop. Why would I do that? Why would I, I'm getting ready to coach these people to do something they've never done before. Why wouldn't I pull them into a conference room, set them down, and just start telling them what I needed to do? Because what are they going to do when they sit at the table? Everybody cross your arms like this for me. How open do you feel? Okay, you, you know, I need them what? I need them in their, in their spaces. I want them by their benches. I want them in their bays because where do they spend their whole day at? This is where they're what? They're comfortable, right? That's what I'm trying to do. So if I'm going to coach you, I always try to do it in your environment in a way that keeps you comfortable and relaxed. Because if you're comfortable and relaxed, you will do what? Open your, open your mind up. Right? It takes away a lot of the stress that you're doing there. How many people's ever had one of your owners or managers say, and I know Ron would never do this because Ron's a really compassionate, caring kind of guy. But, but how many people's ever had somebody pull you into their office? Okay, and, and what, what happens? All of a sudden you do what? You, you lock it down, you go into kind of battle mode. So I want you to make sure that you know, you're creating an environment for them that's not stressful. This is what I normally do. If I have an employee that has an issue or a problem, I would walk up and say, hey, Angela, walk with me for a second. Okay, and so I'm not gonna put her in a room. I'm not gonna put her in a closet. I just say, hey, walk with me for a second. Because I find if I can get you just to walk beside me and we can kind of get away from everything, you and I can have a what? Have a conversation. I'm not in my environment. You're not in your environment. We're just doing what, Angela? Just." just walk and I always laugh because when my people hear me say hey walk with me for a second <laughs> right normally it means that I have something I need to work discuss coach you on but I want to do it in a way that is non-stressful you does that make sense so anytime you have to deal with an employee issue you're doing with a coaching thing that might be a little bit stressful just walk up to them and say hey walk with me for a second and I try to keep it very low-key I try to be non not accusatory Coaching to me is, is I, I've got you in a position to fail. You don't know what to do, so my job as a manager is to do what? Help you help you learn that, help you do that. So I, I've invested a lot of money in you. I don't want you to go away. I spent a lot of time finding you. I don't want you to go away. Contrary to popular belief, my job as an owner or a manager is not to try to get rid of you. My job is to try to do what? Because I don't want to have to go through what again? I don't want to have to go through the hiring process again. I don't have to go out and try to find these people. So I know they think my job is to try to get rid of you. The last thing I want to do is to get rid of you because I've already spent all this time and energy and effort in hiring you. I want to try to grow you and keep you.